Right, good morning. Welcome back to the channel. Um, hopefully we notice a bit of a change in the camera stability. Um, yeah, so I've got the different camera mounts now. So I've, before I had it on one, one mount, one facing forward, one facing towards me. But now I've got two mounts now, so the front facing one is in the middle and the one facing myself is I put it a bit higher up because uh, I can now, it's just I'm not limited by the camera facing forward. So hopefully it's a bit better, a bit more stable. So this morning um, we are going to a builder's merchant. We did it, it's only around the corner from base as well. <clears throat> but um, we got there last night about half past three and we got refused basically. Um, the reason being, all, all the delivery trucks were coming back at that time. Well, the, the main reason was we're not, we wasn't booked in till, till today. Um, I think we were just trying to get rid of it today so we can crack on with other jobs. But that's not an issue. There's no, no argument. It was only around the corner from us, so it was worth trying to get in yesterday, last night. So, like I say, we started a bit later. Because I think they're only open at half seven and it's only 20 past seven now, so I want to be the first one in there, if you know what I mean. It's a bit of a tight yard to be fair, went in, like so, went in yesterday, obviously. It's just a one way system, one gate in, one gate out, which is the best setup for it, really, so you can't really turn around anywhere. Not many places for me to. Hang around. Oh, I can hang around in there actually. That's a bus stop. Yeah. The gate's open anyway, let's have a look. Oh, I can park right behind the butty wagon if, if, if they're all closed. And they are closed. <laughs> right, fair enough. That's the entrance there, so I can park here. So let's make sure I am off the road. Yeah, so I'm off the road. Um, I will have to wait, obviously, till half past seven now. So, <clears throat> wait for this buddy wagon to open up, and then we'll uh, <laughs> we'll get a sausage and bacon sandwich, I think. Speak to you shortly. Oh, very good. Right. And in we go. So I spoke to someone. Well, I spoke to this, this guy here. And uh, we're going to drive through the yard. Like I say, it's a bit of a, a tight yard. Then we're going to a, a goods in area. See how we get on. Cheers, mate. Am I okay to go around the vans, yeah? Right. Yeah. Looks a bit tight, that's all. <laughs> nice. I was going to try and let that van go, but he was uh, not moving. So this is a spot here on the uh, on the left. You need to back, go through the gates and then back into this uh, HGV loading area. It was a bit tight. These cars aren't open either. Back in there. As a don, just in case anyone starts messing up behind me. Like that one. <laughs>
I don't think I'll look, looks like I've overcut it there, but I can work it out. Quite a deep section, this one. I'm uh, doing full power to the, uh, the line, yeah? Mm, closer to that line, so yeah. Closer to that line, there. yeah. Okay, good there. Sounds. Thank you very much. Cheers, mate. Okay, today I'll jump in move forward. Or... Yeah, yeah, sounds. I'll get unstrapped. Right. So we're all tipped. While it was getting tipped, um, I spoke to the office. And they said for me to go back to base. Didn't ask too many, too many questions to be fair, so turn around the corner. So I'm going to have to edge out on this one. It's rush hour, and it's quite a busy road. It's probably the best gap I'm going to get. Right, so yeah, um, nice easy tip that one. I actually had a, a sandwich while I, was, uh, while I was waiting to get tips. Walk back out onto the main road. Bacon and sausage, bam, brown sauce. And a can of pop. Wait, let's see what uh, the depot has to say. And then we'll uh, speak shortly. Right, so we're back at base. Um, I've already been and done what I needed to do at base, which was um, go and rescue another driver. Um, the you will arrive at your destination at eleven twelve a.m. Yeah, one of the night drivers for General Harledge. I've gone over his, his driving hours last night so he's been stranded this morning basically he pulled over in Warrington onto a layby or I, sh I should say he's going he's close to going over his driving hours um, but he wasn't, he wasn't going to make it back to base basically so he's pulled over he's done the right thing and um, he's not going over his working time just his driving time and um me and the transport managers went down, he jumped in the van, I jumped in the, the truck. So that was it really, just bringing the truck and unit, uh, the truck and trailer back. And I'm back in mine now. So uh, back to uh, back to business. <laughs> so we're going over to uh, Pollington now. Picking up a load, and we'll. Um, I, don't, I don't know where it's for, or if it's going to get dropped today or not. But we'll uh, we'll get over there for about quarter past, or maybe half past eleven if I stop for a break, and then um, we'll go from there. I'll speak to you very shortly. Welcome back. Um, so yeah, so we're in Leeds now. So I'm, on, I'm loaded, and we've got a drop in Leeds. Um, bit of a it sounds a bit of an odd one really um, when it's coming by odd probably not the best word odd but <laughs> a bit different to what I'm, uh, I've been doing so it's not a, I don't think it's a building site I don't think it's um, a builders merchants so I'm not too sure there's, nothing, there's no website to it, there's no, it's not like a big thing like 
you know, Red Row Homes or Miller Homes or anything like that. I'm hoping it's obvious. The postcode area on Google Maps, um, it only covers a small stretch of, of the road that I've got on my paperwork. So hopefully, fingers crossed, it's obvious. Ah, oh, right, there you go. Plenty of houses being built there. Is that the entrance to the yard? Possibly is the entrance to the yard, but that's not the road I've been given, so let me just have a little look down here. Ling Lane. If Ling Lane is super, super tight, if this is Ling Lane on the left here, can't be it. That's a yeah. That's someone's driveway. Ling Lane. Let's have a look at it. Um, let's drop it. I'm gonna pull over here. Let these cars go past. A very tight road that so options now I'll put a quick look on Google Maps if I drive down that road is it a dead end is it a turning space things like that I think it's that entrance before So there we go. <laughs> it is down Ling Lane. What best is give him a call? Is a let his dog walk walk past us first. Hazards off, indicator off, on. Should I say? And away we go. So yeah, I'm just going to go and find a turning area. Sat nav has already found one. I'm just going to see if that's suitable. <laughs> but like I say, it's probably best to always check, pull over and check. I had a contact there rather than trying to work it out myself. Right, so this is the turning circle that Tom Tom's given me. Based on my. The bus is going down there, which is a good sign. <laughs> it's a good sign. I'm going to take both these lanes. Don't want to get myself in any sticky situations. <laughs> Everyone, maximum clearance there. So it's the next left. I send the road that comes back onto the main road. That looks nice and nice and wide. That's why I'm I'm trusting this 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 route. This looks a bit tighter. It's not for long. Yeah, so spot to the contacts anyway. Um, I'm not going to put that on the video, the discussion. But um, but yeah, it just it confirmed exactly where it was. It's on the on that tight road, and knock it down a gear. And it's all and we're okay to drop. So he's got the forks ready to go. Be a school around this corner. I need to take it on the other side of the road. So hopefully, no one's coming. Let 
time around here. Nice 24 plate Mustang. Almost there. <laughs> right, so Ling Lane. This is the uh, the road up. I'm not going to go all the way to the middle of the road. That's not the not, that's not the one. That's not the one. Yeah, I'm not going to go all the way to the middle of the road. Just because I need a nice wide turn. Have a look down it. We need to have a look down it before we commit to it. Yeah, we're good to go. Now we said, head down Ling Lane. You'll definitely be able to see the site. So that's LA Building and Joinery. That's just someone's. Yeah, all these nice houses. That's just someone building a house there. Is that where I'm going? Yeah, no worries. Where do you want me? Thanks. I was going to turn around first. So, they've got no forks here. But they're going to use the forks on the uh, excavator. Back a bit. There we go. Right, get this unstrapped and we'll uh, speak to you very shortly. Right, we are all tipped. It is a. Uh, it's getting on now. It's four o'clock. I've uh, been.
been told I need to go back to Pollington to collect another load. So it's going to be a very late. If I just drive straight to Pollington. <laughs> Go straight straight to Pollington and straight home. It's going to be seven o'clock, but it's going to take about an hour to uh, to get tipped, to get loaded. Sorry, there. So yeah, it's going to be about eight o'clock by the time I finish. Guy with the pipes has been waiting a while as well <laughs> to get on site. All right. So, like I said, with it being so late, I'm going to double check with the office and see what time I can actually get down to a uh, sale con because it's going to be getting on. I don't know if they, if they close at five or something like that. It's going to be close to that time. Right, I'll see you later. Right. See you later. So yeah, we're good to go for uh, Hollington. So it's going to be late, but I did have a early start today, a late start today, should say. So we'll get to Hollington about quarter to five, and it's about two hour journey back, give or take with traffic. So by the time we get loaded, about six, and then it's going to be <laughs> two hours back. So it's probably eight o'clock by the time I finish. But uh, yeah. There's no point recording that. Um, so yeah, I will uh, I'll end it there. I think it's been a productive day, and we'll uh, we'll catch up on the next one. See you later.